Conversation is going to be had. Don't get it twisted. They're going to have that conversation. I'm not saying it's right. Or I'm just, they already having it now. They, they actually, not greatest Laker. Of course, I'm just saying they ask, they've asked the same question I've asked. Who's the, the greatest Laker? No. If LeBron has a good leg, a, a, a standing legacy with the Lakers, will he go down as the greatest Laker of all time? Well, like the well, fact they, but well, that's relative. But I'm saying, but but I'm saying exactly. I'm saying, but at but, least three rings. But I'm saying the fact that and that's what I'm getting at. That's what I'm saying. Like, and that's very. Everybody here thinks he's going to get three, me included. I feel like he's going to get two more. Uh, with the Lakers. yeah. I feel I like he's going to get two more rings with the Lakers. I see that. You know what I'm saying? So, and but of course you gotta, you know, you gotta make it happen before you. But at the end of the day, they added. Montrez Hare, who's a fucking problem for for teams, he's a nightmare for defenses in the offensive Not that great of a defender. That's the irony. Huh? Not that great of a defender. He doesn't have to be. He doesn't have to. Be. You got AD there. You got fucking who else he had back there? Marcus All. You know what I'm saying? Like no a former defensive player of the year. You don't have to. That's what I'm saying. He got all and that, you know, just gets handed to the Lakers right now, bro. This is real talk. I'm still saying Clippers can beat him. Not in the playoffs. Why not? They didn't play. Not in the playoffs. Because like, cause the same reason you just said. They got Marcus Gasol. They got AD. They, they got, don't match up well with them Clippers, though. I don't know guy. why. Body. It's going to be body, head, bangers. I mean, they got uh, Serge. Off, bro. Huh? You got Serge. You got Zubac. Bro, not Serge? Zubac. I mean, Serge is a body. You can't say he's not a body. Okay, yeah, he's, okay, Serge is okay. Nah, bro. Anyway. Serge? I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Serge Ibaka? Nah. They, yeah, I don't yeah. know about that. But at the end of the day, yeah, Serge, don't get me wrong, I'm saying he's, he's good, but I'm saying, okay, Serge, and, okay, who else? Z- Zubak? Anyway. You Serge, know, yeah, you got, you got, uh, man, that nigga, nigga not gonna Anyway, we had, sorry, we had technical difficulty in the studio, bro. By, by the way, I, if they don't know, we had the new complex. Why we took such a break? Yeah, we had to get the new uh, the new establishment up and we going. Had the compound. We're gonna have some visuals for y'all very soon, but we had to get everything up and going. It's very nice yeah. in here. Okay, you got Serge. Okay, I'm gonna tell you the, the boy who's really looking good. You got the Frenchman, your boy uh, Batum, looking ten years younger. Yeah, but that's that ain't. I'm oh, talking, nice. nah, bro. Have you watched them? You gotta watch them. Yeah, bro. Batum is good. I'm talking. You're not listening. What I'm talking about. I'm what talking about, about a, a problem in the paint. In the paint, bro. I'm talking about defensive paint, paint presence and rebounding. That's what I'm talking about. Zubac. Okay, bro. We talk in comparison to Montrez Harrell, Anthony Davis, and uh, Montrez is and, not that good in the paint. Montrez is not that good in the paint. Okay. Well, I see he's he an energy about, guy. He gets about seven, eight boards a game. For energy guy. He gets about get, seven, eight all boards the energy he is. He's how many? Energy. I, I, I'm interested to see how many rebounds Serge Ibaka gets than he gets in comparison. I'm interested to see that stat. I, I, off the top of my head, I don't know, but if it's anything remotely close to each other, from a nigga who fought like four inches shorter than he's shorter than, you know what I'm saying? Like, I, I don't know. I got to look up that one. You know what I'm saying? I, I really do, but I'm pretty sure. If, I it, up, yeah, if, if Serge ain't averaging double digit rebounds. Oh, but they already beat him. That's what I'm saying. You beat him every time you play him, though. That's cool, but they ain't get it. unfortunately, they didn't get the opportunity to play him in the playoffs. Unfortunately. I'm not saying they didn't choke. I'm not saying they can beat. I'm just saying I'm interested. I, I want to see that matchup. Too. I'm just saying like it is not going less than six. I can say this, man. If if all the like I said, I don't know why. I can't explain it. They don't match up well with them. I mean, they I beat them. If they play small ball, possibly. But I feel like if they get into a half court game with the Lakers, it's going to be a problem. For whatever reason, I don't know if it's because you know LeBron hates goddamn claw. Yeah, he did. I mean, he still does. They beat I him mean, this year. I, I mean, I, he did, but I mean, I don't know. Bro, if he, what else is it? it, it I don't LeBron's still their best player. I, I don't know if he has that mystique over here, LeBron. Like he used to. I mean, they I win when they play. They win. I don't know. Well, we like I said, the, well, the only thing that matters is the rings at the end of it the day. It does. I'm so, not saying. I'm saying no, it'd be interesting. So it's yeah, not going to so, be no okay, sweep. Cool. So hypothetical. So we're saying since we're doing hypotheticals, that's cool. So hypothetically, if the if the all I'm saying is hypothetically, if the Lakers stay healthy in the big man position. They're not going to lose in the seven game series to the uh, Clippers at all. I'm just, cause, I mean, it's, that's the hype. Because keep in mind, we don't know who's going to stay healthy and who's going to get hurt. So this is all hypotheticals, obviously. I mean, obviously, they're way better at big man. But my thing is, if Paul George stops being, he's not bubble George no more. He's out of the bubble. Well, I mean, he's hooping, but we'll see, man. That's what I'm saying. We'll see. I'm saying that's the one team I can see beat them. I don't see Denver doing it. It's just something about Denver. I, they don't, I don't get enough scoring. Jamal's is inconsistent. 
It's obvious a lot of niggas love the bubble as far as production. TJ Warren is not the same. Yeah. I don't think Jamal Murray right now is not the same. He might get back to form. Yeah. A lot of niggas love the bubble. Now, maybe they gym rats and just going to the same gym was a different, you feel me, different, uh, you know what I'm saying? Different yeah. mentality. Yeah. It obviously he benefited, correct? Yeah. You only going to two or three different gyms. Mm-hmm. This, and he's probably a gym rat. Mm-hmm. TJ, TJ Warren, probably a gym rat. They say, you, you talk to a lot of NBA players, they say, dog, there's some niggas in practice who look like world beaters, but something about them bright lights in that game, they just couldn't do it. Mm. You see what I'm saying? So obviously it's something about that bubble, going to the same gym, two or three different gyms, you just, you was comfortable. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I'm not saying he still got time, but I'm just saying, I mean, I don't know what you think. From, the, from what I've seen from Denver, they don't look the same. They're mm-hmm. still Denver. Yeah. And, you know, as a kind of like maybe as a big man team, it's going to take them longer to jail. But they don't look the same as they was. I don't see them beating the Lakers right now. Even though see, the worst matchup for AD is Joker. Yeah, I don't see nobody beating the Lakers right now. I yeah. mean, I feel you. But well, I, well, I don't see them competing well, again. Like, now, before these pickups in the offseason, I would say they're they not invincible. But the fact that they got Harold and they got Gasol and they got they got Wesley Matthews, Wesley Matthews, bro, like these are all great. Now, granted, players. yeah, I don't think they're playing Wesley at all. That's what I'm saying. He's they're saving they, them. They're saving all these players for the playoffs. I agree, bro. but it's a lot of niggas on this, the Clippers still. But I'm just saying, I think that's a good matchup. I know one player they don't have no more. He played with the Lakers. He one does. Yeah. He Man. right. Yeah. <laughs> he does. Yeah. They, they they didn't keep him for whatever reason. But maybe they wanted Serge. I don't know. Maybe he wanted to leave. Maybe, like they said, I mean, and granted, correct, they were mad about all that load management. It got ridiculous. I mean, if, 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 if reports are to be believed, he didn't like that load management. He didn't like, because, I mean, let's be real. Kawhi, Kawhi is still an NBA player, bro. He gets a lot of slack. You know, he's uh, the nice guy, the laugher. But at the end of the day, if reports are to be believed, Kawhi gets what he wants. You know what I'm saying, right? He forced his way out of two teams, correct? He basically punked the Lakers, went to the Clippers, and got Paul George, correct? He lets his uncle do the dirty work from what it seems, right? I mean, he's just, he's definitely a nice guy, and we all love the laugher, and he's quiet. But he's still an NBA player, and he definitely has an ego, and he gets what he wants in a lot of situations. He forced the hand of a couple organizations, correct? Yep. So, that being said, what was my point? My point being is, it's just, it's, it, it's still, I mean, he's still an NBA player. It's, the Clippers are still a, you know, a team to be reckoned with, I think, personally. But, other than that basketball, I mean, you know, it's cool to watch. I don't know about the ratings or anything now. There's no more, uh, no more Black Lives Matter. I don't know if I believe the ratings, to be honest. I think we were talking about the other day. When we that, when we talking about that the other day? Um, what were we saying? I don't think it was Black Lives Matter. I don't know if I believe the ratings the way they the way they advertise and all this other I mean, stuff. Of course they're saying that. Anyway, uh, we going f- football? No. Nah. Oh, college. Yeah, I mean, the, we, we, we can get, the, the get it. We can get it to the national championship game. I mean. What were your thoughts? Alabama on is still Alabama. Obviously, they proved that they still out, out, out there being Alabama. Right. Um, they also are showing people that you know you stock can go up and you can still lose. I mean, let's see, Trevor Trevor Lawrence is still going to be number one quarterback. I bet Fields will probably be number two quarterback. You is know. Fields leaving? He better. Why yeah. would you stay? I feel you. Shit, I don't know why. Like that's not the smartest. He got to be eligible, right? Because he transferred from Georgia. That was two or three years what, ago. Yeah, what are you going to do to stay, take another chance and risk getting hurt? Okay. Or, or somebody else coming flourishing and passing you up? Because, I mean, look, at least you can say you came out of a stacked draft class. You came with Trevor Lawrence and some other good quarterbacks. Whatever happened to our boy Kelly? For, he was, remember, Lawrence replaced him. Shout out Paul. Paul said he was fresh. Oh, I don't know what happened. He went to, I forgot what school he went to. He went to, like, a weird school. He was at Clemson, something Kelly, and then, uh, you know, Lawrence took over. and uh, Sunshine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Sunshine took over. Okay, so uh, let's get into that. Or do you want to get in the game? Go ahead, get, get into that. 
You want to get in the game or get in the draft? Let's see, let's take let's do the game. All right. Oh yeah, you did. You said you know Alabama's Alabama. Mm-hmm. It's crazy what levels there are. I think the lack of game experience hurt Ohio State. Now. Obviously, they, they molly whopped Clemson. But the lack of game experience hurt Ohio State, obviously, versus Alabama. I totally agree. Clemson would have gave Alabama a better game. I agree. Yes, because they played 10 games. Clemson lost to Notre Dame and then beat the shit and out of them. it's basically become a rival lately. Right. And they played they actually played 11 games. I, I just don't think Ohio State was ready because they – I don't think they played Indiana. Wasn't Indiana really good this year in the Big Ten? I don't know. They didn't even play the Big Ten, ten champion, or they did play the Big Ten championship. But five games, bro, like, you're not ready, bro. Mm-mm. Now, I'll give them a hell of a – they beat the shit out of Clemson. I'll yeah. give them that. Mm-hmm. They definitely did that. But, yeah, something about Alabama, bro, you got to play a full season to mess with them. Like, mm-hmm. it's just levels to it, bro, like. This, I mean, this is the craziest season ever. I mean, you know, they they canceling NBA games left and right and not enough players because of COVID. It was a wild season. And you know what? We're still going to get football. You know that, right? Uh, Division two, like you know, all the black schools, the MEAC, they're going to play in March. So we can see Dion. Yeah. Dion's coaching Jackson State. We're still getting football in March, like college football. Now, granted, it might not be on to the level of, you know, a Division one school, but we're still getting it. You feel me? Um, uh, so let me get into Trevor Lawrence real quick. Because speaking of Kelly and all that, Tua Taluga, what he do? He overtook Jalen Hurts, correct? Correct. Won a championship. Correct? Correct. Now, this is after Jalen Hurts won a championship starting, correct? Correct. Okay. Now, he lost the job again. And, two, two, and uh, Hurts got it back in the championship game the next year, correct? Mm-hmm. Okay. Hurts transfers to Oklahoma. Doesn't get back to the national championship. But he does have one starting under his belt. Has two total, correct? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wait. He got one when they he, beat he, Georgia. They beat Georgia. Yeah, he started. No, or that one when yeah, he got when benched. He came and bailed him out against Georgia. He bailed out Hurts. But the year before, he started and won. I want to say LSU. That was an LSU 10 to 6 or some shit. Correct? He has one starting for sure. That's why it was such a crazy thing to bench a, a, a national championship in a national championship game. Right? Yeah. So, we, I mean, we can look it up, but I'm for sure he has two. One as a starter, the other one, Tua to, to, to Luga bailed him out. But the year after that, Tua to Luga, like I said, gets rebenched. Four hurts, and they lose. I want to say that's the Watson year. Or maybe they're going to win them years. Or maybe that's the Trevor Lawrence year. So, like, these niggas went back and forth getting benched, starting, correct? I want to say Tua Tuluga has two, and Jalen Hurts has two, right? National champions. Chips. Yeah. Jalen Hurts, he has one with the... Uh... He one starting and one... No, nah, he didn't get one with Oklahoma. He has one starting, yeah. and he has one where he got, like you said, he got bailed out. I want to say Tua Taluga won too. It, maybe not. Uh, well, you got to understand. No, because he got hurt. Tua Taluga got hurt the next year, right? Um, what happened was, I think Hurts lost to uh, Deshaun Watson, right? I think so. Yeah, with Ed Clemson. Um, but that was the year he might have retook over for Tua Taluga, right? Because remember, he, he took over for him in the National Championship as well. He took over for Tua. The, the he, year got, beat, he got rebenched. The, the year they beat Georgia. The year they beat Georgia, Hurts got the job back. And then Tua came into the national championship actual game against Georgia and won it. But he also came into the national championship the year before. Tua Taluga. Again, two. I don't know. I just know he played and won. Tua Taluga definitely won one in the yeah, game. I don't know it's when he started, but I mean. He started that game or he came in, in the game and won one. I know he came in the game and beat Georgia for sure. Yeah. In the national championship. Yeah, Hurts started the game and then two. Yes. Came, yeah, he came in. And okay, game. so so Hurts got the starting job back in the season. It wasn't yeah, during uh, the national championship yeah, the next uh, year. And, 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 no, he got it back during the season, and then in the national championship game, he was. I guess they hit a wall, and they said, "Tua, get out there and go and win it for us." Again. Yeah. 
Mm-hmm. Okay, so I had it wrong. So he got benched twice in that championship game. And so Hurts got smart and went to grad school and transferred to Oklahoma as a grad transfer. Yeah, yeah. I, I thought he had won one just himself before two losing. Oh, Hurts? Yeah, I don't think he did. Okay, either either.